So you just get um, your tumbler. Okay. You pour it into it. Oh, this color is beautiful. Thank yeah. you very much. Yeah. Then you pour it into it and add um, more cold water. Okay. okay. So it can be equal parts. So if it was one cup of um, um, the iced tea, the mixture of the yeah. tea, you can just mix it with another oh, cup of, um, of water. Okay. So you just keep it in the fridge. It will just continue to infuse itself. Okay. Two hours tops. So that way you also even avoid having um, onions entering your eyes. Anyhow. So now we're going to add our pineapple into our dish. As you can see, it's becoming more and more colorful. Don't worry if it's burning by the side. It's just building flavor. Then we're going to add our chicken as well. So you have like a like, if you don't have the cornstarch, you can still use the, the flour, ordinary flour. You still mix it the same way that you mix it. And you just pour it over. So the rice is almost done. So most of the time I usually don't like um, plain white rice. So you can you can make it plain as you want, but um, I chose to put um, different vegetables just to make it colorful and at the same time give it more, more, more crunch. vegetables in there. Oh, thank you very much. Okay, let's dig this one first. Mm. This is the one with the pineapple, right? Yes, wow. the one with the pineapple. You would think that they don't um, they don't marry each other yeah, like that. Yeah, you know, you know, at first when you said um, pineapple <laughs> and chicken, I was like, it doesn't add up. It doesn't go. It, like, it doesn't Even go the first time all. that I heard of it too, I was like, uh, but okay. with practice and the more I do it, the more my family loves it. I just decided oh, to just make it a staple in the house. Okay, let's taste. <laughs> I can't wait. I can't. <laughs> my truth is. Let me listen to your judgment. Mm. 